Hello again, everyone. Thank you for joining me. I hope you're all well. Okay, so back in contract, Bill. And um, yeah, so for the first time in my life, in the last episode, I made a slight mistake. First first mistake in my life. And um, yeah, I forgot to put a uh, door leading through here. So um, yeah, this has been so annoying. But what I've um, discovered is if you put a little box in front of the door like this, or a paint pot, you can walk through so if you're um in a similar situation yeah this makes it a lot easier because i don't have to jump or anything and mess around trying to line myself up it just works so what i've done is i've gone around i've done all the cove in and the top bit painted all the rooms so i think these are all complete i'm pretty sure they are uh both sides and um sorry psycho but i'm leaving the doors open except from that one and uh well i'm not going to run through but you can see from here that yeah it's all done and what we're going to do next is we're going to jump through and install this so you can take the windows out whenever you like during the build which is bloody useful so oh i'm over here now so i'll quickly show you that i have done all the rooms so i take a second so that is all done and then as I run through, you can see that all of the rooms are, well, accessible and they've all been plastered, painted, skirting board and all that. And obviously now I can't get out. So what I've got to do at this point is um, say I am stuck. So teleport. So we can never get back into this side of the building now. And where am I going this way? That was jumping over there. Look. <laughs> Um, yeah, so jumping also makes you fart on this game. I'm glad it leaves that green thing. Because that really trolls some uh, content creators online. So yeah, obviously now I can't remove this window because you need to remove the screws. And you can't do it through the window. So that's done now. That side of the house the bins empty and in here is all the rubbish and the generator and the fuels um yeah before i forget there was a couple of patches wasn't there on the wall around here um loading back in i couldn't go over them still but i could do them individual boxes so i just went through clicked all of the red bits until it had all gone so that was strange. I don't know why that happened, but yeah, that was a thing. Uh, okay. So, um, next stage. So we bought this plot for 500 grand. Um, yep. Nice. Well, that's all right. And it's 757. So we're not going to do quick sell. We're going to do auction again. Because the reason why I did this little experiment was because I wanted to see how much we'd get for it through auction because it's got all of the rooms. So we've spent 500, okay, so 546. So we'll call it 550 and then we'll start the auction at 757 and we'll hope that someone gets into a bidding wall. Uh, yeah, nice. So that's that all done. And obviously we've got a little bit more profit as well because we've got all this um, rubbish in the back here. And it's uh, yet again another very ugly house. I am sorry about that. Yeah, hopefully in future updates we can do more with building so they don't all look like that. Did we build that one? I genuinely don't even know. Okay. And... Uh, what way am I going here? This way. Oh, nice. Yeah, there's just random NPCs standing around. Not quite sure what's going on. Okay, and take that. Take this over here. Were them trees there before? They look new. And yeah, the turning circle on this van isn't 
very good, is it? We could do with being a little bit longer. Or a little bit, um, different. Uh, I really should have gone up there. Yeah, um, let's quickly do that. So, I'm going to go up here because I've got some rubbish on me. So I can dump that off. Range Rover's still up there from the live stream. Okay, so let's dump this. There we go. And then we can shove this in here. And I'm not going to worry about the black bags for now. Okay. Uh, generator, we'll take that out too. And the fuel... Oh, jolly. You've got a red bag in there, mate. What are you doing? Oh, it's going to be one of them days today. I've had a bad day today. Yeah, some really, really annoying clients. Four in a row. And uh, yeah, it doesn't take much, does it? Like one client can bug you up. But, um, yeah, at least it's out of the way for another week or so. Uh, do that. Actually, no, it's not. No, it's not. Oh, well. Right. So, I'll get this done off camera. I'll see you in just a moment. Okay, and I thought I'd just quickly show you this. So, if you dig out the bottom row, you can, um... To save it all falling down, you can uh, yeah restack the stuff that's already compressed straight back in. So that's what I find works best for me, and uh, yeah, it just makes it a lot easier because obviously when you've got all this stuff falling around you, sometimes you might accidentally pick one of them up or whatever, or trip over one of them, so it keeps it just a little bit clearer. Um. I'm not sure how many of these boxes go through and become one of these. Uh, I probably should figure that out at some point, shouldn't I? But it doesn't matter now anyway. Right, so let's get the rest of this done. Almost there. And we have got some more bids on the property, so we'll have a look at them in a second. Right, paper. Is more paper going to come out? Nope, not by looks of it. Nice, nice, nice. Um, and the rest of the shelves are empty, aren't they? Yeah. So let's turn that off. We'll go and, uh, yeah, dump off this rubbish and, yeah, sell it. And then we'll have a look at these bids. Nice. Yeah, new bids again. Excellent. Yeah, so it might be an exploit that I'm uh, doing here. But, yeah, if it is, it might help a few people out. Half a tank of diesel left. Okay, right, here we go. So it's mostly paper, so let's stop here. Not with that on, though. If it does that, just jump back in and it'll sort itself out. Okay, it doesn't always do it. But obviously it's where brake is also reverse. Right, Wazda. Nice, and... Nice. Plastic there and metal here. Okay. Oh, oh, auto save. Okay. Here we go. Hello, mate. How you doing? I'm over here. Cool, that's all right, isn't it? 
So over 50 grand in um, rubbish. Cheers, mate. See you later. And let's have a look at the auction now. So my property is this one. Uh, auction. Yeah, look. Nice. Cons. Typical. Um, parcels spelt wrong. Uh, all right. Well, I mean, that's still very good. Um, so Megan, I think this, yeah, this will push over a million as well. So that property, um, 546 and then we sold it for 836. So that's 280 grand profit. And that, no, what am I talking about? Um, so 290 grand profit plus the 50 grand of rubbish, um, at least. So yeah, 340 grand worth of profit. Excellent. Yes. And we're millionaires, Rodney. Nice. Uh, so I don't really know what to do with that money. I suppose buy one of the northern blocks. Um, property. Uh, like North Town, that's what I mean. Uh, 1189 is the cheapest. And we can't quite afford that, can we? Okay, so we need to go and do a job then, don't we? Uh, contracts. Renovate. Um... Goodness. Uh, oh no, I don't think I've got time to do this one because, uh, yeah, saying it's going to take 50 minutes and yeah, I mean, I've only got a little bit of free time left. Now I've got enough to do this recording, obviously. Uh, might have to do a short episode, this one, unfortunately. Yeah, but that will mean that we can get one of these big plots and then I suppose we can just go for it. Easy, easy. <sighs> Perfect. Yeah, so I wonder what design point means then. I wonder whether that's the... What's happened to his wheels? Oh, all right. I wonder whether that's the um, stuff that you put in, like whether it's five-star furniture or no-star, for instance. No idea. I feel like some weird stuff's going on with the lighting today. I did get an NVIDIA um, graphics card update, which I always install um, straight away. As soon as I see it, I'll download it and then I'll be installing it in the background and then I'll think that both my monitors have blown up because um, yeah, it, it temporarily uh, turns the signal off doesn't it so both your monitors go black oh god that sounds awful doesn't it so when I started off my channel by the way um, I had two monitors I need them for work and uh, yeah my um, Dell monitor was a 24 inch monitor that I got off of um, eBay for 20 quid it was excellent I've still got it the only trouble with it is um, it's DVI only. So I was thinking I could use it with my um, little Chromebook that I also got second hand. But um, unfortunately it's not supported because it's DVI. Um, anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, so yeah, I do have two monitors. And when I've got this other new monitor um, because of 
supermarket simulator. Uh, yeah, I use my original monitor as my second monitor. But yeah, I do highly recommend two if you've got room for it. But you don't have to spend loads of money. You can just get one off eBay. Uh, nice. Hello? Why is it? Oh, because I've got this out. Okay. Smash that. Yeah, I'm not going to worry too much about um, taking furniture around to sell. And I'm not going to worry about putting stuff straight in there either. Um, it would be nice to have some kind of... Uh, quick way of doing this, but then I suppose it defeats the object of the game, doesn't it? Why did that just fall down? Oh, it's getting dark. Uh, oh, I don't know what to do now. And my goodness, I want a pizza. I think I'm going to get one, um, yeah, the day before my birthday, have a nice big pizza. Like, delivered. Um, it's very quiet at night, isn't it, on this game? Nine o'clock. It'd be nice if we still got traffic. Maybe there is still traffic, but it's, um, yeah, it just turned right down. Uh, how am I going to do this? I can't just have the whole episode of me doing this. Yeah, because obviously when I was doing that house, I did most of that off camera because it was just an experiment. And uh, yeah, so I have been in this recording process for quite, quite a while already. Uh, I'm just trying to work out times. Yeah, so I'll pop you on pause and I'll do as much of this as I can. And I'll see you in just a moment. Okay, so um, I've done all that off camera and um, yeah, we will have time to do a proper episode now. So we've picked up all the rubbish as well. So if I go over here, uh, nice. Okay, so and then we've got the stuff in the van too. So we're going to be skint and um, we are going to have to go and do, yeah, other jobs. So I've just run upstairs. Um so we'll do that. Uh, three floors. Yep. Okay. 25 grand and we need to go here. Because I've got one item in the back that I need to sell. Oh, we're going to have to dig it out. So, unfortunately, I won't be able to pause anymore. So, I've got to leave all the mundane bits in. Um, yes, yeah, so we're going to sell this bit of furniture. And then we'll go to the city hall, get the deeds for the property. And hopefully we'll be laughing. Right. So, this shouldn't be too difficult. Oh, that one. Hello, how are we doing? Uh, yep, this. Nice. Right, thank you. See you later. So that's that done. Yeah, because I've got a grand plan for this base. Uh, and then we need to go City Hall. So M up there. Nice. Okay, let's get going. 
Yeah, and three floors. So I am going to have to um, spend quite a lot of time planning this base. And we'll keep running out of money, so I'll keep having to go and do extra jobs. Um, but that'll break it up a little bit, won't it? So that's all right. Okay. I reckon with enough practice I could get maybe even through that door, but probably not with that van. Hello, how are we doing? Uh, 25 grand. <laughs> okay, thank you. Nice one, see you later. My goodness. Um... So I'm just trying to think, whereabouts is this place? Is it one of the... Yeah, it's right up there. Um, okay, and we haven't got the Jenny on us or anything at the moment either. So we should really go back and do that. Um, is there a job that we can do? Uh, logistic. 64 to 80. Hmm... All right, let's do this one. I know it's not that much money, but seeing as we're kind of going in that direction anyway. So then at least we're not wasting fuel. Okay. Yeah, sorry I'm all over the place. I'm, so I've been shuffling clients to uh, yeah, be able to do a full episode here. And I thought I'd quickly put my washing on as well. Because I won't have time tomorrow. Because tomorrow I'm hoping to a really long live stream. So, yeah, work has been manic. Trying to, yeah, make time for that. Yeah, I'm trying to do too much at once. That's what I'm doing. That's what I always bloody do. That's what I'm known for. Right. And I made another cup of tea as well, because I'm losing my voice. Which is perfect when I have to talk for a living. <laughs> okay. At one point, though, genuinely, at one point, I was doing six episodes a day. Um, and... That was probably for about the first six months on youtube and uh the most episodes i ever uploaded in one day was uh on christmas day the year before last and i did 27 uploads in one day which is ridiculous but it was worth it i probably got about one sub from that Okay, uh, I do believe I've got some rubbish on me, so let's go and drop that off. There we go. couple more boxes. And we will take the black bags down because we'll be uh, trying to sell them for some extra cash. And that timer won't start ticking down until we actually arrive on site, so that's all good. Yeah, because I don't think you can build a house for just under 1,500 quid. I wish you could. Okay, here we go. So yeah, I am going to have to do this on camera. So this bit coming up is very boring. Sorry about that, everyone. because that's going to be awkward. Okay, 
and let's move this and then put plastics in so just that one okay paper glass metal metal bin bag nice turn that off shut the doors and off we go yeah so this is actually quite good because this can be a complete fresh start isn't it with no money and just putting as much money into this building as possible um especially the end of it where we put decorations in because we'll try and get that decoration point up um yeah and then we'll see whether we can make a million off of it or something i don't know we'll see if we can really uh rake some money in not that um it really matters now because i know this game never really ends because you can just go on and on and build yeah nicer and nicer houses on yeah like the best plots and all that but um the actual game itself we've pretty much completed now haven't we um i do need to check a side quest actually was that car always there yeah maybe it was so side quest or side goal purchase a city land okay so that's the only thing left we've got to do we've done that already but yeah you have to do this one first okay so let's get this stuff done that over here Open the door instead. Glass. Okay, so that's all of them. So let's send that in. We don't get much for that, but that's all right. We don't really um, care as long as it's gone. Oh no, was that? Oh no, sorry, it's plastic. Send that in. And this one there. Nice. Grab these. Okay. Right, I think that's all of them. Hello, mate. Yes, please. Nice. Right, thank you very much. I'll see you later. Have a good one. Um, I didn't pick the generator up, did I? Bugger it. Yeah, so the generator and the fuel will quickly go and grab that. I should be refueling the van as well, seeing as we've got that fuel on site. Come on now. Can we go this way? Oh no. Nice. It wasn't nice at all. Okay, so that way is more awkward. Come on now. In we go. Right, so 33 grand and then we'll have another 7 or whatever it was for doing that delivery in a minute. And that'll be enough to start off with. That'll probably get us the building supplies, I imagine. Right, chuck this in. Um, I think that's got enough fuel. Fail. Yeah, and we've got enough fuel as well. So let's go and do this delivery job now. Can we buy that bit of land just so we've got a shortcut out to the road? Oh, we got stuck on an invisible wall there, I think. One of the places I used to work was out in the middle of sodding nowhere, and it always used to flood. And, um, yeah, back then I was, um, bang on it with keeping my car all nice and clean. I've never had, like, really nice cars, but they've certainly looked alright. And, uh, yeah, one of them was just out in the middle of nowhere. The road always used to flood. 
and um, yeah, if you came across another car like leaving the site or whatever, you had to back up for about 16 miles. It was so annoying. But that was just because the boss was so tight. He was offered a really good place, but it was about 60 quid a month more. No, it wasn't that little, but it wasn't that much. And uh, yeah, so he didn't do it. And we were all bashing our cars up as well, because um, where it was down a lane, there was always like hedges that would overgrow and scratch your cars you drove past. Really struggling with that box, wasn't I? Nice. And he bought these stupid little containers that were made of plastic, but looked like they were made of metal. And uh, yeah, a few weeks after getting them and transferring all the tools over, place got done over. Who would have thought it? And the only reason why he got them plastic things was because he bought a container off, um, I think it was off eBay, to do uh, tool storage with. And um, yeah, to deliver it, they wanted a lot of money because obviously a lorry would have had to go down there. So it was just him being super tight. But luckily, none of my tools were in there. I always just bring all my tools home. Because sod that. Nice. Okay. Excellent. Cheers, mate. See you later. Right, let's get going. 13 minutes. Yeah, that last job that I did, um, the demolition one, it didn't take 50 minutes. Oh, look at that. We had to go to Town Hall anyway. Why does it sometimes not mark the navigation? I don't know. Right, quick slurp of tea. Cheers, everyone. So nice. Easy. Move on, mate. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. I was looking at something else. Don't text and drive. Okay, here we go. We need a Mercedes Sprinter on this. I love a Sprinter. And some of them are pretty rapid as well. Surprisingly. Oh. Fail. Right, that's right, we're only going over here. Right, so we'll get this delivery done, get a few more quid, and then we'll go and have a look at our plot of land, shall we? Oh, God, jolly. It's why I'm under pressure. I'm trying to rush. Because I know I can't pause. Okay, that'll do, sod it. Oh, God, all the fun, isn't it? All the fun in the world. And that noise that you get here, I don't know whether it's a waterfall or something, well, a fountain, but it always makes me think that my microphone's buggering up again. But it's just in this area. And my goodness, that was awful when all that was going on. It's still not perfect, I know that, but um, it's a lot better than it was. 
Because, yeah, all that money that I spent on it, and it just, like, felt pointless. And then some of the other streamers that I watch, like, I know their microphones are only, like, cheap. And I'm just thinking, like, why did I spend all this money when their microphone sounds 20 times better? Uh, right, so that's that all done. Hello, mate. How are we doing? Nice. Uh, thank you. Perfect. So 7,900. See you later, mate. Take it easy. So it does look like it transports your personal car to um, the site as well if you use the vehicle provided. So that's good. Right, let's go and have a look at our plot of land. 41 grand. Oh, everything's rhyming. Right, but we're out of uh, timing. Didn't make any sense. Um, can I not go this way? I feel like it'd be quicker, yeah. Come on. So when you press escape, you lose your previous key press. Um, I don't know what's going on up there, but the draw distance does seem to be bugging a little bit at the moment, doesn't it? Right, so that's that monstrosity that we built before. Oh, it's back here. Okay. Yes, please. Right. And we can shove the van down here because we're going to be using that to move supplies around anyway. Okay. And... Right, so this bit is going to be quite boring, the planning part. I am sorry about that. So we're going to go as big as possible. We're going to go as big as possible. Okay. And... What I'd like to do is take a big old chunk of this. Like that. Put that up there. That along there. And have a door near the front door that goes into what's going to be the garage. And... We'll have another door at the back here too. I know that that's way too big for a garage, but I'm sick of UK garages. <laughs> we have tiny, tiny little garages. It's just not fair. Um, right, so walk in to the living room. Our garage is way too big, isn't it? Ah, sod it. Walk into the living room, kitchen at the back. So kitchen, diner. Um, we're not going to wall them off. We will wall this bit off and then put one across there as well. And then we'll go for a pretty big bathroom, I'm being honest. And... Hmm. Uh, no, we'll have the laundry room incorporated here. So, yeah, we'll just leave that as is and we'll have an office downstairs. Right, and then we need to be able to get upstairs, don't we? That always helps. So, straight stairs, wide. Why not? So, come in front door, straight up. And then first floor, land in there, and then straight up to the top floor. Okay. So we need to wall off these. Uh, 
Uh, and yeah, we'll be able to get doors in there so we can wall this off as well. Oh, I've buggered up now. I've buggered up. So take them walls off. This needs to be a bit of a corridor. Um, but not on that side. That'll be the kind of master bedroom or whatever. Okay, that across there. And then we need a corridor. Easy for me to say. Corridor going up here. Take this out. That across there. Okay. So five meters squared, that'll do. Um, dressing room. All right, we'll have one of them. Yeah, dressing room, why not? Uh, we need a bathroom up here. I know that hasn't got a window. Um, so, yeah, the houses next to me don't have a window in the bathroom. They just have extractor fans. So it is a thing. And the bathroom door can be next to the main door. And then this. This one will have the door open out. Because it's so small. And what can this be? I don't know. Music room. Why not? Okay. So that's that done. Uh, hallway we need to put in. So this is all hallway. I think um, this is where it gets buggered up when you're putting the carpet down and whatnot. So I think if I try to drag from there to there, when I'm actually doing the place, it will um, go wrong. Okay. We need a door up the end here. Leading into that room, and then we need a door here. I've still buggered up. I've still buggered up completely. We don't need this. So take that off. That is not a hallway. Interior door there. Okay. Uh, and we need to incorporate a bathroom here as well. So I know that that's a massive bedroom. Um, God, it's so difficult. I don't think this is going to be a... Um, Bedroom, actually. Uh, right, so main bathroom there. Oh, I should have put that there, shouldn't I? It doesn't matter. So main bathroom, and then this can be a separate room itself. No, I hate this. I absolutely hate it. So let's take out all of that. Okay. Right, that is going to be the bathroom. Yep, 
Yeah. Okay. So that's the bathroom. Um, this can be a kid's room. Yep. And then up here we need a guest room. With its own bathroom. Eight meters squared is fine. Nice, that across there, that across there. And interior door. Wardrobes and stuff can go there. Maybe a little dressing table. Yep, so that's all good. Um, this one can just be a standard bar, uh, bedroom, but huge. Uh, yeah, so that's that done. Checking that you can access everything. And then top floor, this is going to be quite the build, isn't it? Top floor, this is the landing, so we need to block this off. Sorry, Jolly's brain is trying to figure stuff out. Um, interior door here. And here. No, this is still going to be too big. Um, maybe that. Yeah, I think it's always going to have to go pretty much all the way down. So let's get rid of this. Uh, that will be all right. So we'll have another bathroom up here. Which can be a massive one. This. Erase that. And that. Don't know why I did that. Okay. Room there. Room there. Yep, that'll do. And this wasted space. Okay, and then get some doors in. Oh no, bugger it. Sorry everyone, I'm not doing this on purpose. And my goodness, this is going to take a lot of building, isn't it? Okay, so we're fencing that off. And that, that'll do. Okay. Right, so we need a bathroom up here and we'll pop it in this one. And then this is going to be 
bedroom and that hopefully that counts as two yep it does uh and then why not we'll have a library and a gym this is going to be a flipping huge games room there's no way into this yet Yeah, and I don't think there's a way of flipping uh, how the door opens. So I'm just trying R, and it's the same as the scroll wheel. What about control? R, no, it's the same. Right, so that's um, that bit done. And then we need... Uh, we don't actually need it, but let's have another room up here. TV room. We'll have a TV room right at the top of the house. Why not? This is all hallway, so I need to put these in. There's a helicopter circling over, so if you can hear something in the background, it is actually that. And right, what else should we have at the very top of the house? All right, let's have another storage room. Like a big old attic. All right, that'll do. Um, and I still need to put windows in. I've just thought, I can't save it, can I, without doing the last bits. So, uh, we will have a window in the garage, but one of them small ones. Let's put the front door on first. Uh, so, double door. That. And unfortunately, usually, when um, the helicopter's circling around, it means that someone's in a bit of bother right we're going to have long windows at the front of it no at the back of the house so two of them triple window that'll do and That office can have a triple window. Bathroom is going to be one of the small ones, so half. And then we'll have a few of these in the garage as well. Okay, so that's window sorted out downstairs. First floor, um, bathroom. That's all good. Um, double windows. So yeah, it won't be symmetrical. Um, music room, no windows in there. This is mainly about just getting some cash, isn't it? Uh, that'll do. And then this top one. My goodness, we're at 54 minutes. My goodness, I'm going to be late for work any second. Right, so we'll check that. Um, quickly have a look through. Uh, door coming in. Garage. That, that, that. Um, we probably should have another exterior door on the garage, shouldn't we? Yep, that'll make it easier as well. Um, so that, that, that. Uh, interior door. Nice, nice. Right, ev everywhere is accessible, yep. First floor, yep, 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 yep. Nice, second floor. Okay, done. Interior wall isn't enclosed. What interior wall? What are you talking about? What's it talking about?
Oh my goodness. I might just have to end this. I've got a horrible feeling though. If I do any wall work, it's just going to destroy everything. Is it this? Like through the stairs? I just don't know. So I'm going to have to end this one here and just hope for the best. So thanks for joining me, everyone. I do really appreciate each and every view. And if you've enjoyed this, please feel free to join me in the next one. So cheers, everyone, and bye for now.